What's up everybody, it is Tadpole Superhero, and today we're doing something super different from what I have been doing. We are playing something super retro, playing Mega Man X. Probably, if I can get to the title screen. <laughs> there we go, there's our title screen, Mega Man X. So what's happening, um, I'm not going to be doing Mega Man X as a series, I'll actually just be playing this, um... I don't even know what's going on anymore. <laughs> okay. Oh, there, there's, <laughs> there's our title screen. Look, I don't even know what I'm doing. Okay, so I'm go not going to be playing this as a series like I have with my other Let's Plays. If you notice in the title, it says Tadpole Plays Mega Man X. So, <laughs> the way this is working today as we play around with the title screen, I'm going to get us into the intro stage. Let's, let's get into that intro stage. Okay. So the way these Tadpole Plays videos are going to be working are... I have to remember how to play this game. Okay, there we go. Um, is that every Friday I'm just going to be doing whatever. Like, today I'm playing Mega Man X. Next week it'll be a different game. So this is actually a game I did not grow up with a Super Nintendo. This is a Super Nintendo game. I did not grow up with the Super Nintendo. I'm just going to start playing. We'll see how good I do without uh, while I'm talking while playing. But I did not grow up with a Super Nintendo. My first home console was the N64. And, uh... So I actually... The first time I ever played this game was last year, 2014. Never never played Mega Man X or any real Super Nintendo games until last year. And it is, it is quite the gem. It's excellent. I was actually... The reason I started playing it was because, one, it's on the Wii U Virtual Console, which is how I'm playing it. And two... It is, uh, and two, I've always wanted to get into the Mega Man games, and so I actually, <laughs> I did a Google search and said, what, what is the easiest Mega Man game for, for a newcomer to the series? And everywhere I looked said Mega Man X, so that's, that's what I went for, and let me tell you something, I'm, I'm terrible at this game, but I really enjoyed it, I have beaten it, I beat it once, and I haven't played it since I beat it. And I've been, I've been wanting to replay it again. So we're not going to be doing this as a series. I'm not going to play through the whole game this time. But I'll probably come back to it at some point. Uh, on one of these Friday Tadpole Plays episodes. So we got our little mini boss. And this, I mean, I had heard everywhere. Oh shoot, I did not mean to press that button. <laughs> I've heard, I'd heard everywhere this game is just like amazing and you know I mean there's all these videos and reviews about how amazing Mega Man X is um, and I was like you know what some of these people have to be like nostalgia blind so me coming into this game playing it for the first time ever you know it'll probably be good but it's not gonna be like the best game ever well I'm not gonna say it's the best game ever it's not my favorite game ever but oh my gosh this game is so good it's it's incredible it's really quite amazing um, nostalgia Nostalgia, nostalgia what? Who's, who's got nostalgia about this game? This game, it's not about nostalgia. Nostalgia, I'm saying nostalgia like 5,000 times. Uh, look, this game's amazing. If you did not grow up with a Super Nintendo like me, you've never played a Mega Man game before. Uh, the only Mega Man games I had played before this were, oh shoot, which ones? Mega Man 64, more commonly known as Mega Man Legends, but I, had the, I played the N64 version called Mega Man 64. And... Mega Man X Command Mission, which is a RPG featuring our protagonist here, X, um, which is a super cool game, but it's very different. So I never played a you know regular side-scrolling uh, jump and shoot Mega Man game until until this. So it's you know that's what I wanted to get into, and this is a great place to get into the series if you haven't played haven't played any games like this before. I'm getting my butt kicked. There we go. Okay. Yes, yeah, so this is a great great way to get into the series if you've never played a Mega Man game before. Uh, especially if you're not, you know, someone who's played a lot of these retro games, side-scrollers. I'm not going to lie, they made games more difficult back then. <laughs> you'll, you'll read in a lot of places, you know, older gamers will be like, man, they made games harder back then. Uh, for someone like me, you know what I mean? I grew up with a Game Boy and an N64. It's not like... 
you know, I started gaming with the, the Wii or something. I grew up with a Game Boy, N64, but man, NES, Super Nintendo games, they made them, they made them much more difficult back then. So I know there's a mini boss that I'm coming up on. How many of these cars do I have to blow up? Oh shoot, I'm gonna die. <laughs> that would be pretty funny. True story, true story. The first time I played this game, I actually died about 10 times before I beat the intro stage. So, bear with me here, guys. I don't know how far I'm going to play through here, but we'll, we'll see. How many of these do I have to destroy? Thank you for the health, sir. You're a very kind and generous robot. Okay, it looks looks like we got something something good going on, maybe. Or not. Come on, where's my mini boss? Pretty please. Oh, well, that didn't go so well. So anyway, I hope you guys don't mind watching somebody terrible at this game play through it. <clears throat> I know there's supposed to be a mini boss in this part, so I don't know how many of these cars I'm supposed to blow up or what. I don't know what I'm doing. Clearly. I've only beaten this game once, and it was, it was quite, quite the struggle. It was totally worth it. Oh, jeez. Totally worth it. It's such a great game. But man, it was not easy. It was a hard fought battle. Okay, here we go. Mini boss time! Or, well, boss time to finish off the level. Oh, we're just gonna start fighting. Oh, shoot. No! No, stop it! What am I gonna do? How do I beat this guy? It's so powerful. I don't know what to do. Oh no. So yeah, you can't beat him. Worthless piece of scrap metal. What a jerk. What a joke. What's gonna happen? What's happening? We're saved. So anyway, I would encourage anyone who, like me, did not grow up with an NES or Super Nintendo, if you got a Wii U, pick this up on the Virtual Console. It's so good. And it really gives an awesome taste of, you know, what games were like back then. Um, honestly, the Super Nintendo, I can understand why the Super Nintendo era is a lot of people's favorites. They made some really, really good games back then. Uh, and this is this is one of, one of the best. Here's our buddy Zero. Hanging out saying, hey, you know what? We're, we're going to help you. I'm going to help you. You're going to become stronger. Maybe even you'll be as powerful as me. So this is our buddy Zero. We're, we're uh, robot dudes. And we hunt down other robot dudes. We hunt down bad robot dudes. We're maverick hunters. We hunt down robots that have gone evil. So anyway, here we go. We did it. All right. In this screen, we got a little password. Cool. That's cool. All right. So now, this is the hallmark of every Mega Man game, pretty much, uh, that you get to select the order in which you take on the different stages. Um, so Chill Penguin is the most common starting stage. And we're, we're going to do that one. Yeah. You can also switch between these things. Um, what's the button? There we go. The map. So this shows you actually where in the world these stages are. Just chill penguins at the top of a mountain. Launch octopus is at in a sub submersible base. Armored armadillo or whatever you call him. Is he armored armadillo or? Yep, armored armadillo. Is it a mine? Storm eagle. Yeah. So anyway, this is going on. We're gonna fight. We're gonna fight uh, chill penguin. So here we go. This is the most common starting stage, and I can totally get behind that. It's probably the easiest boss in the game without having the item he's weak against. And the stage is pretty short, pretty simple. Not going to lie, I died a bunch of times the first time I played this, but I think I, I think I can do better this time. Oh my gosh. Yeah, these guys. Oh, I hate these guys. The, dude, the axe dudes that throw stuff at you. Thank you for the health. I'm going to need a lot of those. All right. There we go. Maybe. Maybe I could do something right. 
I actually, <laughs> first time I played this stage, I didn't even get this far. I got wrecked by those uh, axe dudes that launch the the things at you, that hit the hit the blocks at you. Okay. No, stop it. Okay. So one annoying thing about this, these games and the classic Mega Man games is enemies respawn when you go back a screen. So you want to, I mean, it's a, it's a good thing because it encourages the player to keep moving forward. You know, don't, don't, don't backtrack. Don't, don't try and, you know, go back. Just keep moving forward. But it does get annoying sometimes, especially for a new player. Oh, geez. This is, this is not good. <laughs> it does get annoying, especially for a new player. Oh, jeez. But with a little bit of passion and patience and determination, you can come out triumphant. All right, so we have our first of these capsules. Each of these capsules has Dr. Light, the good old man who created Mega Man and Mega Man X. And he's created these uh, capsules to give us upgrades. He hoped the world would allow me to choose a, a peaceful path, but apparently that's not the case. Destined to fight. A new champion, because the original champion was the original Mega Man. All right, acceleration system to boost your speed. Awesome. Okay, one of the one of the problems though with for me in terms of the fact that I played uh, Mega Man X first is it it's kind of ruined me for the um, the original Mega Man games, the classic ones. So I have these boosts. I can do this dash move. And you can do it either by double tapping in a single direction or pressing A. So that's that's pretty cool. Well, that that wasn't cool, but you know, other stuff's cool. No, stop it, stop it, stop, stop it. This is not gonna end well, guys. I can I can sense it. What was I saying? Oh yeah, it ruined me for the uh, the classic Mega Man games because the X games are just so so much more refined. I think, at least Mega Man X one. I mean, I know the games get a little more complicated uh, down the line. It's not the the games aren't as consistently good as the classic games, but they're still they're still very good. So now we have we have this uh, armor. I forget what it's called. Ride armor, I think, is what it's called. Is I think the technical term. So we can run run around and punch stuff. And you can fight other dudes in ride armor. Get out of my way. All right. So now we can get out of. Here. Oh wait. Ah uh, shoot. Where do I want to go? Oh no, I can do this. <laughs> if I could figure out how to do it, I'm trying to get to a uh, a hidden secret. Oh, I think I have to get up here with something different. Yeah, I can't destroy those like this. Okay, I have to come back later then. Yep. Okay. So I can't do this right now. Alrighty then. So I like keeping my my beam charged up to get the strongest attacks. Cause I'm cause I'm a noob like that. I don't have I don't have the strength to handle you know the no charge shot uh thing that some people do, which is quite impressive. Oh, I also died on this section like over and over the first time I played this game. So see, I've gotten so much better at this game than the, than the first time I played it. It's a good thing I didn't uh, play this game blind for you guys. <laughs> that would have been truly embarrassing. This is this is still pretty bad. But anyway, this is our little entrance to the boss room. We can't run back. This gets us to the boss, Chill Penguin. So let's go and kick his butt. He's the easiest boss in the game, uh, you know, discounting whether you have the right weapon to fight him with. Oh, jeez. I'm eating my words, guys. Yep, so we just watch his movements and fight him back.
The really handy thing about the X Games is you can slide on the walls and wall jump, and that just saves me over and over. So every single boss has, you know, a number of different attack patterns, and as long as you pay attention to them and learn their attack patterns, you can beat any of them. But that's the key to victory, is learning their attack patterns and knowing how to attack them. Which, Chill Penguin has the easiest attack patterns. That's part of why he's such a simple boss. Um, yeah. This guy actually took me a lot of tries to beat the first time. Just like everything in this game, it took me forever to beat him. And I thought he was so hard. People who play, who are like experts at this game are just like laughing at me right now. Alright, so he's just about dead. We got him! Yes! Oh, I beat the entire level and the boss without dying. That was good. That's a nice, nice way to end. So, anyway, that's it for today. I'm going to come back to this probably in a couple weeks. Uh, I'll come back to this every now and then. And play a little farther. And, yeah, that was fun. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Tadpole Plays. Uh, what's going to happen? So I just got the shotgun, Ice. Which gives me a new weapon. So every time you beat a boss, you get their weapon. Which is awesome. Just like the classic Mega Man games. So anyway, you get a little password here. Uh, whatever. Because this game doesn't have a classic save system. Okay. So anyway, next time on Tadpole Plays, we're going to play a different game than Mega Man X. But every Friday, I'll be doing something different. I won't be doing sort of a series... I will come back to a lot of these games frequently. So like Mega Man X, I'm going to come back to this game down the line. And I promise, guys, I'll, I'll, I'll practice some more before I play it again. <laughs> so it won't be quite as embarrassing. Um, we're going to come back to this game. Next week will be a different game. We'll see what it is. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Let me know in the comments below what you like and what you liked about it, what you didn't like about it. And let me know what's your favorite Mega Man game. Have you played any Mega Man games? Do you like Mega Man X? Um, if you haven't played a Mega Man be game before, why not? You should you should probably you should probably try a game. You should probably play this one because it's awesome. Okay, anyway, that's been all for today. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.